coin. It's currently valued around 40,000 US dollars per coin, which is just insanity. It's had a crazy run up to that number the past year or so. And uh, although the waters have been a little bit more choppy lately, it seems like it's gonna continue on that trajectory. We could be looking at the future of money. It could eventually be hundreds of thousands or even millions of dollars per coin or it could come falling back to earth. Nobody really knows yet, but today we're gonna mine it. <laughs> oh, okay, um, that, that's just Jessica. She, she, you know, she and I go way back. You guys, you guys don't have to worry about her. So here we are, this, this is our apartment. We've got an old school TV. We've got our energy usage on the wall. We've got a, a rug, which is on the wall as well. Not sure why we do that. Here's our fridge for all of our G Fuel and pizza and Jack Daniels and Starbucks. Use, use code TMARTIN at G Fuel to save some money. See what we've got going on outside. There's a hospital, there's a police station. Uh, something Cupid, I can't tell what that says. We've got a fire extinguisher over here in case we need it. And it uh, looks like we've, we've got some text messages coming in. So um, we're thinking about mining. Any advice? Erie says, think. That'll be a good start. Well, I'm not here for that sarcasm, Eerie. So we're we're gonna need, I mean, we've got food here in case we need to stay alive. We've also got motherboards. So this is gonna be 150 bucks. I'll buy that. We're gonna need a power supply. That's 200 bucks. Rig frame is gonna be 150. And then video cards, we're gonna get the GoForce Miner X. Boom, just splashing out on them. Now it looks like these already came in. So we're just gonna go ahead and take, what the? You want me to install it over here? Okay, take this, install that over here. Take this, install it over here. Is that our PC over there? Once you've assembled the farm, press F. You will see a terminal where you can start the mining process. There'll be lots of unintelligible words and digits, but you'll learn to understand it after a while. If you mine something, you'll be able to exchange coins for dollars and vice versa right in the online wallet. Use the default login, admin, the default password, password. I think you should be able to figure out the interface for yourself and it looks like uh looks like eerie was was banned for saying dial only bearded 35 year old nerd from despair well your boy's about to be rich off of bitcoin so calm down mine beep coin mine rage coin mine drop coin or stop all right so i'm gonna say mine beep coin we're gonna get this thing going so this is the crazy part back in the day like many many years ago you actually could straight up mine bitcoin just off the of computer or like eventually if you had something with a few graphics cards and stuff that would work nowadays you need basically super computers and, and super specialty things and stuff but look at this we've got our first beep coin coming in here and uh before you know it your boy is gonna be mega rich so jessica about um about last night you did you get yourself cleaned up? Don't give me that stank face. Listen, it, it was it was a good night. You guys can see we've got our, our power output going here. That's one of the things that's the most expensive. Obviously, computer equipment runs off of electricity, so that's gonna cost us money, especially when you're going through high profile algorithms and, and stuff to be able to solve this Bitcoin. I, I'm gonna be honest, I'm, I'm not an expert. I know just ground layer, how it works. I do know there are these like equations and stuff that these computers are solving. Your computer power is going to it and then whoever's kind of mining that block of Bitcoin is gonna be rewarded with the, the different pieces of Bitcoin. So we're, uh, we're just, we're gonna have to see how we're doing. Looks like we've got quite a bit here. I'm just gonna leave that going. Let me check out our cache. So we're going to be admin and uh, and password. So you guys can see we've got 0. 0.656 Bitcoins and $250. Currently, a Bitcoin is worth 138 bucks. Bro, could you imagine being in on this uh, on this level? Rage coin is 193. Drop coin is $1. So technically, Rage coin is actually the, the most, you know, kind of valuable thing as of right now. So what we're going to do is I'm going to exchange 0. 0.763. I guess we can do now 0.809. It's gonna constantly be going up. Don't have enough funds to complete the trade. Oh, I wanna sell. Sorry, sorry, I wanna sell. 0.852, we're gonna make $130. Obviously that's exciting. We're gonna be able to eventually go in here and we're gonna be able to buy another $250 graphics card, which we already can. That's gonna put that there. We're gonna be able to set this up and then boom, all of a sudden, we're mining Bitcoin even faster. Ah, so we've got an exchange here. We can see the price history. I like this. You guys can see Ragecoin started off below Beepcoin, kind of had a, a bit of a, a, a spike right here and it's been on a downward trend since. Beepcoin is, is staying pretty solid. Dropcoin is, is just kind of getting started. Might be a good idea to get in on that early, be an early adopter. Ooh, Beepcoin's dropping, shoot. Okay, so we're gonna wanna wait to sell all this Beepcoin that we're currently 
mining un until it's back up around that like 175 mark or more. Ooh, electricity bill for day one was $62.15. The money has been debited from your account. $62 for one day's worth of electricity? We now have $71 total to our name. I don't think we're going to be able to run both of these GPUs at the same time. We're going to have to end up selling at some point, but I just I don't want to yet. Looks like we've got a bit of a rebound here. Dropcoin still isn't doing much. Let's let it hopefully bounce back up a little bit. Like I said, let's let's sell around that. I mean, 150 wouldn't be bad, but 175 would be ideal. Now, the crazy part is, is if you did this, Back in the day, back in like, I think 2009 is when the first one, the first block broke or whatever you would have call it, 2010, 2011, somewhere around there. If you just used your home PC or your gaming PC or anything like that, you could have mined hundreds of Bitcoins. And if you would have held them all the way through till now, you'd be a multi, multi-millionaire. There are people out there, you know, nerds, I use that term endearingly. There are guys out there who were into Bitcoin and we're like, oh, this is this is cool. This is new technology. This is of the future. They did this stuff and they made boatloads of cash, which is insane. You can't really do it anymore. There's way too much big money in it. It takes way too much power. Oh. We died? I'm so stupid, man. There's, there's a hunger gauge up in the top right that's been slowly going up. We died from hunger. We've also got fatigue and stress that we're gonna have to watch out for. I don't know if we can sleep I don't know, like, can we can we sit down, go sit next to Jessica, something like that? No, I don't think we could do that. I don't think we could sleep. Obviously, this is a very early access game. Um, wow, we we died very quickly. Now, we've got different, uh, different exchange rates happening this time around. Looks like it's randomized, which is kind of exciting. This legitimately looks like the real crypto market. Just trading off of pure speculation, hype doesn't really make sense crazy inflated prices we're in the middle of of not so great of an economic situation but everything's just shooting up yeah i mean this this is perfect this is this is like real life here we go baby we're at five out of eight graphics cards that's what everything is rated for our our frame as well as the the psu and stuff like that we could actually buy more frames so we're going to be able to buy these set them up and and have multiple rigs going all at once but um we're looking pretty good rates on on you know beep coin are, are solid Ooh, look at this dude these are going so fast 221 dollars just like that since i started talking to you guys i had just put the last sale through and the last graphics card on there which is is kind of exciting like look at this and that sentence right there we just made 38 bucks not too bad so you know it's not easy work it's not hard work either. We're, we're out here mining, doing our thing and making some money. And uh, I, I don't even know what the point of making the money is though. Are we going to be able to spend it on anything or is it just like make as much money as you possibly can and make sure you don't die? Rage coin and drop coin are worth next to nothing, bro. Beep coin's the way to go. It's definitely, you know, kind of showing its muscle here. And uh, we're just, we're going to keep on mining it, keep on doing our thing. We've got 1.43 here. So let's go ahead and exchange that. I mean, we've got 600 bucks. I would imagine that's going to be able to cover the power bill. So we can just go ahead and uh, let's buy a new, a new card here. Be able to throw this guy on there. We almost have a full rig. Looks like Beepcoin slowly kind of dropping back down to earth. We're hovering around this $100 mark. We've got a nice support line there. I'm just going to sit here and pretend like I know technical analysis on stocks and stuff like that. Um, so the, the thing is, is obviously we're, we're mining and that's essentially free money. Like we have to, we have to pay for the electricity, but we're always going to make more back than what we pay for the electricity. So we could keep that going on our Beepcoin for right now, since it's the most valuable asset. But the thing is, we can also buy coins. So if we take a look at the rates here, I mean, Ragecoin and Dropcoin are, are are super low around that one to two dollar mark, maybe five, 10, whatever it is. We could potentially, instead of taking our money and reinvesting in graphics cards, we could buy a boatload of those coins at a low price and then hold on to them for a little bit instead of mining them. That's going to be a way to, to kind of accelerate our progress. So we'll we'll see how it works out. It does look like Beep Coin's on a bit of a tear right now. So let me, uh, I guess, let's let's go ahead and sell some. We've got 6.5 here. Got to go. Oh, we don't want to buy them. We don't want to buy them. We want to sell 7.354. We're going to make $900 on that. Now it is day four. We are going to end up having to pay some uh some some you know electricity today which makes me a little bit nervous but i think we should be able to get a psu everything going for our uh, our third and it looks like final mining setup here 
splashing out, bro. We're, we're buying two at a time now. It's 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 happening. I like games like this where you like you, you slowly build into it and then as time goes on, you kind of get the wheel turning even faster. It's it's kind of fun in that regard. I am a little bit worried about our, our power bill. We've got $1,400. Our power bill should be coming sometime soon, so I think I think I'm just gonna try to hang on to what we have for now. Eight hundred and fifty-five dollars for our power bill for the day—that's insane. So we're paying, you know, three hundred fifty thousand dollars per year in power, well, north of three hundred thousand, maybe not three fifty. But uh, I mean, think about think about how much we're making here. So we've still got thirteen hundred dollars in the bank. Let me uh, let me go ahead and sell. We're going to go 5.3 of our BTC, and then we have uh, four more slots left. So we're going to go in one, two, three, four. We're going to splash out $1,000 on graphics cards, and it looks like that's going to fill up our wall. Now, I don't know. Can we can we do more than this? Let me, let me go in. Can I buy more rig frames? Ah, we could have up to six or maybe even nine in this bad boy. Check it out. We've got our full wall. This is as far as we could possibly go. So if we take a look at other rig frames, we do not have enough free space to purchase more of those. So you could have six total frames with six power supplies, six CPUs, and what is it? Eight, eight per, so 40 graphics cards. We've got, you know, well over $100,000 invested into this thing. But uh, I mean, just... Proof is in the pudding. Let's let's take a look at what we've got going on. Look, oh my gosh, still going up. These altcoins just absolutely not doing anything. We made the the right call to do what we did. So we're just we're, I mean, look at this. We've got fifteen point five eight three thousand dollars just like that. We're down to point oh eight. Look at that. Just made another two point one um, something like that. Four hundred bucks in just a couple of seconds. Uh, we're we're balling. Now, obviously, we're going to have to pay for food, and we're also going to have to pay for our electricity every day, which it's day five. That, that's going to be a little bit scary coming up here soon. We've got about five grand, but our, our I mean, we're, we're doing as much as we possibly can right now. We can't possibly make any more money from mining. So now I'm thinking what we want to do. We, we need to pick out what the, the winning coin is going to be. I think it's going to be Rage Coin. Rage Coin is currently valued at $4.30. So I'm going to say let's let's buy like, you know, a thousand of these so we're gonna exchange 4300 bucks and we're gonna hope over time rage coin is gonna start shooting up and obviously we're gonna be able to make a lot of money off of that trade but for now we're just gonna keep selling our Bitcoin making our money doing our thing I mean this this is this is easy this this is how you become a millionaire right 9 a.m. looks like our daily electricity is gonna cost us two thousand three hundred and eighty one dollars and apart from that your boy is just going to keep buying these other coins in the hopes that one day they're going to end up going up. Looks like it's just the the tale of two idiots down here. They're, they're, they're just not doing anything. And with this trade, we have now maxed out our accounts. So the, the most that you can hold in one coin in this game is 10,000. Obviously, in real life, you can hold as many as you want. You guys can see Beepcoin has kind of pulled back a little bit, but the, the, they're still not doing anything. I don't, I don't know why they're not moving. Our, our first one, they were all over the place, which would have made things a little bit more exciting and a little bit more difficult. I'm hoping at some point these are going to start start bouncing up a bit. You guys can see we are almost to day seven, but uh, we've got 10,000 on each of these. So either one, red or blue, doesn't matter. If it goes up to 100 bucks, we're a millionaire. 200 bucks, we've got, uh, you know, $2 million. 300 bucks, $3 million. You guys know how it works. So we'll, we'll just have to wait and see what happens at this point. I mean, I... I I think we've beat the game. Oh shoot, we've almost died. So let's let's go ahead and, and eat some some breakfast and stuff. We're just gonna splash out. It doesn't even matter anymore, bro. There's, there's literally nothing we can do. We can't buy any more things uh, in terms of PC parts or crypto. We basically just sit here, watch our, our Bitcoin go up, our Beepcoin go up. We've got 31 of them. Let me just sell that for 2,500 bucks. Gotta make sure we've got a couple grand each day for the electricity and apart from that, we are uh, we are all done. Look at that, seven seven point two kilowatt, four hundred ninety five kilowatt hours. I don't even know really, really know what I'm looking at there, but um, yeah, this that's that's how you make a million dollars in crypto, just like that. From now on, it's just a gravy train. We're just gonna wait for these altcoins to eventually go up, and uh, even if they don't, I mean, we we've now got all of this. We've got. $3,600 cash, and it's just like, since I started this sentence, let's sell this for 
600 bucks right there. What I really think would have been cool is to be able to upgrade your setup as you go. So like you get a better desk, you get multiple monitors, you get a, a you know, glow in the dark mini fridge, you get a big flat screen you can put on the wall. You've got like, you know, maybe real girls instead of plastic ones. I I don't know, I, I, I kind of like the idea. I like little idle click simulators like this, um, but um, Obviously, this one is is just really, really early on. Look at this, dude. Sell 22 of these things. I'm addicted to it. 1,500 bucks like that. Easy, easy money. So, uh, man, we were all too late. This could have been us back in 2009, 2010, but um, I guess we're going to have to find the next thing, fellas. If you guys have any ideas, feel free to leave them down in the comments. So, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Kind of a pretty simple game. I, I, I thought there was going to be more to it, but I had a good time. Hope you guys did, too, and uh, I'll see you guys later.